Hi, first grade, it's Mrs. Yu. Today we are going to read a story called Super Tools. A few weeks ago, Lucy's mom and dad bought a new computer home. This is so cool, exclaimed Lucy. Lucy used the computer all the time, but not everyone was happy about the new computer. Lucy didn't know it, but her writing tools felt sad and useless. One day, while she was at school, they had an emergency meeting. Lucy hasn't used us in weeks, cried the markers. Can we demand to be used, asked the crayons. No, that would be rude, but we can remind her how great we are, said the pencils. Yes, they all agreed. Let's remind her. After school, as soon as Lucy came through the door, she grabbed a glass of juice and went right to her computer. She had to write a report about birds. The writing tools watched and waited. When Lucy was done, she printed her report. That night, the writing tools got busy. They worked together to make a picture for Lucy. The pencils made a sketch, the markers drew the birds in the trees. The crayons drew the sun in a blue sky. The picture was good enough to frame. The next day was Saturday. Lucy woke up late. Then she went to get her report. Lucy gasped. <gasps> she couldn't believe her eyes. Who drew this great picture, she asked. Did you draw this? Lucy asked her mom and dad. You know the answer to that, they laughed. Stop joking, you drew that great picture. That made Lucy think she wished she had drawn it. It is fun to draw, she said. Hmm. Lucy hung the picture in her room. Then she took out her pencils, crayons, and markers. I'll draw my own picture for my report, she said. Lucy and her pencils, crayons, and markers worked together. They drew a super picture. From that day on, Lucy kept drawing and the writing tools felt, ha felt happy and useful. The end. Well, that was a cute story. I wonder, because we're coming up on summer, what will you do to keep your pencils and markers busy this summer? Hmm.